What's up everybody? Surfits over here and I am back with some gold. Specifically, five dollars worth of gold in 1835. Absolutely gorgeous. Just take that in. I love the look of these older coins. Just the natural, simplistic design. And how many hands this coin has most likely passed through and blown every single person's mind along the way. Absolutely amazing. For all of you who saw it before when I posted it and can remember, what grading company and what grade? This is just for fun, honestly. Can anyone remember what grade this coin is? And if you can't, and if you never saw it, just guess. What grade do we think this coin is? If I didn't know, I'd just be checking it out right now. I see some scratches. It's definitely not AU. It's definitely not uncirculated, so we're stuck with fine and very fine. Okay, I'm not gonna beat around the bush too much longer. This is very fine 35. Absolutely gorgeous. It still maintains its luster. It still has some of its shine. And the back is the real uh, winner here on this coin, I would imagine. Just because, I mean, it's nicer than the front. Look at that. You still got the uh, shine, the light on the top there. Where that white is. Still part of its luster all on the back. It gets really yellowish whenever the light gets around it. Gorgeous. Yeah, PCGS graded this a very fine 35. I'd be very interested to see what it gets. Um, probably be right around the same number, actually. Probably be directly around this exact number. I've been uh, learning with grading companies recently that if you cross-grade and try to test them, not only are they pretty close for the most part, but you're really going to be paying to have it be either a number up or a number down. So they're really in the ballpark for the most part. And yeah, I wanted to let you guys know that I have decided that the easiest way to get coins graded, modern ones, regular coins, would be to send them to Annex. You don't have to become a member. You can just print their coin thing out. I called them. Just print it out. You can even send money orders into them, so they can, they'll let you even send a money order in with the coins. And all you gotta do is basically use the coin flips, write the number of the coin on the coin flips with a Sharpie or whatever. They're not particular like PCGS. And uh, pack it up and send it on in and boom, within four or five weeks, if that, probably four, you have your coins back graded. So we're gonna we're gonna definitely do this here. I'm gonna print the page out here within the next th two three days, and I'm gonna make a video sending in coins to Annex. And I can't wait, I can't wait, because you know what? I love their holders. They have this real classic uh, round top. It goes over on the top. It looks different. Their holders look different, and I like I like the yellow holders. They're different. And Annex, I mean that's. The oldest, I believe they're the oldest coin, coin grading company. So, yeah. That's what's up. We're definitely about to get some coins graded, y'all. I know a lot of y'all have been excited to see what some of these coins uh, will grade out to be. And that's going to be a whole part of our channel that I think everybody loves. You know, coin grading and just looking at magnificent coins all the time. Well, don't want to make this too long. Really hope everybody has a great rest of their day. This is my 1835 $5 gold coin. They made 400,000 of these. And uh, yeah, I'm Servant Silver. Until next time, friends.